Okay, we're back with Alyssa. Sorry guys, uh, for those of you who have been following me, you know that um, when I get heartburn, it's serious. Long story short, for those of you who haven't been with me for the last couple of years, um, I had my whole like digestive tract like overhauled, <laughs> kind of. Um, I had to have a whole bunch of stuff corrected and blah, blah, blah. So, you know, when I get heartburn, it's serious. So anyway, okay, so we were looking at her charm and this is Alyssa. And where's the thing? Here it is. So that was her gorgeous charm. Very, very beautiful. And her swap. Okay, here we go. I'm going to put that over there because I'm going to use that guy. Okay, so she has a nicely tied in this gorgeous mint green um, lace. I love that color. I love these colors here. And, um, okay, so she did label it. Okay, so this one is her spring card. Um, and in the back, her samplers are um, this the die cut that says with love. <laughs> I have to laugh every time I see with love because somebody gave that die cut um, in a die cut swap and I had no idea what it said. And I was like, what the heck? And I like stumbled over it. It was so funny. Um, you know, you guys made fun of me for like forever, but it's all in good fun. You know, I'm not thin skinned. So every time I see it, I have to die laughing. And she's a cute little butterfly. And she has some flat back pearls and some blue rhinestones. And then she has some bows in the back. So very, very cute. Oh, for those of you who don't know what a pocket letter is, it's the little cards that you put in the baseball card holder things or Pokemon card holders, depending on how old you are. Okay, so this is our spring one here. And let's go to her letter. She said, okay, so my dad was a camping fanatic. He loved to travel. When she was little, she traveled at least twice a year with her little 70s RV. Oh my God, that's so cute. So she did a little camping to, to um, honor her dad. Those are some of my best childhood memories. My mama loved flowers. Anything that had petals, she could, anything that had petals, she could grow it. When my dad retired and they moved to Florida, our whole yard was fruit trees, palm trees, and flowers everywhere. Oh, that's awesome. So this is her mom's card here with all the flowers. She did a um, cute little fabric flower with a heart bling centerpiece and some of those iridescent pearls. Uh, I, on the other hand, uh, just now learning to grow plants and flowers, trial and arrow style. Isn't that the truth? I couldn't keep my cactus alive. Somehow my cactus grew mold. <laughs> like, how does that happen? Um, I hope all your sweet ladies enjoy your pretties and goodies with love, Alyssa. So cute. And I love how it's on this little shimmer pink pen. Um, so this is her spring. So very cute with little butterflies and a little banner and the tiniest little sequin mix on there. Her camping, this is great adventure. And then her mom with her flowers. So sweet. Thank you so much for sharing that with us. We love it. Everything is gorgeous. And sorry I had to do yours in two parts, but uh, <laughs> I was struggling. All right. So last but not least, right? Is that the one, two, three, four? Yeah. We have Shelly. I'm just making sure. Okay. And this, she has a two-part packaging. Um, and hers. I'm just making sure I don't get these confused. Okay. Let me move all this out of the way. This is her, this is how, so your guys' um, come in different papers. So she handmade these envelopes, so they are all different papers. Um, this is her handmade goodie. Um, she did a shaker bag as well. So for those of you who are new to crafting, this is the new rage. When you decorate your um, package, you put little sequins and business inside. Um, so when people open it, you know, it goes everywhere. Um, a funny story, my son got a graduation card from his friend and his friend was like, do not open this card in the car. Wait till you get home. And we were like, okay, weird. Um, so you open it and it starts playing music and it says press here. So Corey don't press buttons. He, you know, he, he doesn't. And um, I pressed it and like confetti popped out of this card everywhere. It was awesome. I loved it. You know how boys are. He was like, Ugh. but thankfully they said don't do it in the car because it would have went everywhere. But I thought it was so cool. Um, to have a, I mean, like you, like I said, you press the button and it like, it was great. 
Anyway, so that's my rant. Um, so she did these gorgeous um, ruffled trim. This is all the in um, embellishment. So she did one with eyelash trim. That's awesome. I've never seen eyelash trim done before. Um, and then some crepe paper, some banners, and some 3D stickers, and some flowers. Those are really cute. You put these on your cards, and you can put, like, hello or something like that. They're very sweet. Or if you have, like, a big rosette or a wand. Um, and Shelly is triple S crafts. I don't know if I said that or not. I'm all over the place right now, guys. Okay, let's go to her swap. All right, so... Inside we have, put that there because I'm going to reuse that. I reuse stuff even if it has my name on it because you can always just cover it up. Or, um, I know a lot of Tiffany's, so yeah. Okay, so she has gifted some gorgeous pattern paper. I love paper samples because you don't necessarily want to buy the whole pack. Like sometimes you just want a little piece here and there or if you don't even like every page you know what I mean like um, so I love when you guys send paper samples these are gorgeous papers this one's my favorite very cute thank you so much for that and inside we have let's see okay here we go I'm gonna move this over to the side oh that's so oh cute I love when you guys have um, unique packaging ideas. So she put all of hers on a three ring binder. Um, Lasagna Burger over at Miss Dolls. Um, oh my God, Lasagna, what's your Facebook page? Or your YouTube. Oh my God. I keep thinking of your old one. But Lasagna Burger over on Crafty Manipulators Facebook. And she's Miss Dolls something over here on YouTube. I cannot, she's going to kill me. <laughs> Girl, I cannot think of it right now. It's late. Yeah, forgive me. Um, anyway, she just hosted a tag flip and it was like this. So that's reminding me. So this is such a clever idea. I love it. Um, anyway, um, so here is her charm. Look at how just, I don't know, delicious was the word I came to my mind. So we're going to use that. How this is, she has a whole bunch of little, um, like, shiny gold and matte gold beads and some tans um, and these teal she put a little this thing tassel and some um, oval beads man I've never seen those yeah I, okay y'all probably like those are old but I like I said I don't do jewelry um, this kind of thing so this stuff always surprises me look at how cute that is like this little flower on a bead thing that's the official term bead thing so pretty. I love it. Thank you so much for that. And then she has my initial. I don't know if your guys' initial is going to be on there. This must be her letter. Um, so we'll come back to that in just a second. And then, actually, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and take this apart. It might be easier for me in my state of mind right now. Okay, come on. There we go. Something flew over there. Okay, so her little sample packs. She has gifted some washi. I had to double check if this is washi or ribbon. <laughs> On the little ribbon thimble thingies. Very nice. Um, she has gifted the mermaid sequin mix. So anytime I see these colors, the purple, blue, teal, gold, pink, iridescent. I call it the mermaid mix. I don't know if it really is. But it looks like a mermaid's tail to me. So that's why it's mermaid mix. There's some clear ones. I've never seen clear sequins. I like this. Very nice. Okay. So those are these are her tags. And so let's get her letter out so we can read it while we um, are looking at it. Oh, she also added some more bling for us. Very nice. She says she had a hard time figuring out what to do for embellishments. You know, sometimes the easiest part is the hardest part. Um, she used the Splendor Collection. She chose the greenery with the flowers because um, it reminded her of her mother. She loved flowers and cacti. 
yes i i love this collection um i have actually i was just creating with this um this paper back here is the michael's hot buy i can't um i forgot what it's called but um she said hers was the splendor package and so she had like little flowers this is live create tell the story that is so cute um, I don't want to open the packaging. So this is what we're saying with toppers. You can make them super simple, but they still have that wow factor. Um, she has Nouveau drops here in the corner and some lace here on the side. Very, very cute. Um, yeah, I think that one's that. Okay. Um, she said her mother passed away just over eight years ago. I'm sorry to hear that. And she is really drawn to gardening. Um, and things like that because it makes me feel closer to her. Oh, that's awesome. For her fatherly card, she just did a masculine design. Um, her father did pass away in November. She did include that in the little cards. Um, so it's the first time making a dangle charm. And she will definitely make more. Yes, dangle charms. Um, <laughs> every Like I said, I think I got a, a um, message from every single person. <laughs> saying is my dangle charm good you know i'm like i don't know i never made these y'all just throw it together <laughs> here's her other card it has that really beautiful silver doily um some flowers with some eyelash trim and a little butterfly it kind of just gives it movement and she has little glitter dots on there i was made for sunny days yes indeed and then um this is the one for her father and it says, while he was gone. Very cute. I love it. I love the wood grain and the masculine. Um, I think the masculine was one that um, everyone had a problem with. Um, so, you know, we make a lot of feminine stuff, but masculine is very hard. Because, you know, men are so simple. You guys know, like, when you follow me. So she has included some um, little cards. Let's make this number one. Yes, today is going to be great. Yes, it is. And then some other little cards and whatnot in here. I like this paper. And it says, handmade it with love. Very, very cute. Thank you so much for those extra goodies. And sharing with us your stories. I like those. I was just trying to see if there was anything else I needed to show. Sometimes... Um, you guys make these clever things and I don't open the packages only because, um, usually I don't open them when I'm like super tired and I don't want to lose who's what is what. Um, because after these reveal videos, you guys are seeing my first reaction to these. None of this is, you know, I haven't looked at it and thought about it. This is, I literally cut the package, um, open. That's all I do when I'm about to record your, your group's videos. So you guys get the raw deal here so when I turn the camera off I go back through and you know take my time and look at everything open it up you know get it all over the place so <laughs> that's what I do but thank you guys so much for watching definitely check out everyone on their YouTube or Facebook if they put it on here um, thank you guys so much for watching if you do want to swap with us it's over on the Facebook page coffee cake and crafting thanks for watching bye